Welcome to the PFLC. I like to come here with me tomorrow and play with my friends. Parenting and Family Literacy Centers are free drop-in centers located in schools where parents, caregivers, and children from birth to age six can come together to learn through play. It's really a place where, as a facilitator, I provide an environment for them to engage with their child. At the PFLC, you'll meet other parents with young children in your neighborhood to share ideas and get advice. You'll learn about the school system, and your child will become familiar with the school staff and routines. What our administrators and our classroom teachers are noticing, those students who've attended the PFLC regularly have adjusted that much faster and better to the school environment. My baby sister can play here too. All of our centers are equipped with change tables, high chairs, and anything an infant or toddler would need. We have a safe area for young children to explore. I like to play with the Play-Doh. Working with manipulative materials such as Play-Doh develops a child's imagination as they sculpt while building fine motor skills that will help with later writing skills. Play-Doh is one of many fun sensory activities you can experience at our PFLCs. I like to play at the art table. Encouraging your child to create artwork with lots of different materials is a great way to encourage their imagination while strengthening their fine motor skills and hand-eye coordination. At our PFLCs, we encourage children and their parents to create together using art materials such as paint and paste. You can also develop your child's oral language skills by talking to them about what it is you are creating together. By going to the center, it gives me time to devote my full attention to her and it gives us our one-on-one -on -one time, even though there's plenty of moms around and plenty of dads around and other children, it just gives us our one-on-one -on -one time. I like to splash at the water table. Encouraging your child to play with materials such as rice, sand, and water is a great way to engage their senses and explore early science and math properties. You and your child can also engage in discussions together about what you are doing at the sensory table, helping to increase your child's vocabulary and strengthen their oral language skills. I come to the PFLC because we have tools in this center to help us educate our children, prepare them for school. Our facilitator is wonderful. She just brings so much to the room that your children benefit from it. I can see the difference the center has helped made in preparing Jasper for school. He was very hesitant um, and it's gotten him into a routine. He is familiar with this place. He's familiar with the routine of coming to, into a schoolroom, having snack time, having circle time, being around other grown-ups that he was unfamiliar with, being around other children. If we hadn't come to a center like this, BFLC, he would have struggled starting kindergarten. I know he would have, and that's just not going to happen now. Sometimes we read books. Reading with your child is one of the most important things you can do. Discussing stories together increases your child's vocabulary and comprehension and builds a love of reading and learning. Each center has a book library. Parents and caregivers can borrow books to read with their children at home. The libraries also include resources on parenting skills and child development for parents to use. My daughter started coming to this center since she was about one. So I've noticed a lot of developmental um, uh, strategies that she um, learns from the classroom and implements them at home. For example, like on her own she is picking up a book and singing it's time to, you know what I mean, singing the songs that um, the teacher would sing in the classroom. To see her at one year old, you know, get a book and not necessarily read but tell me what's going on in the book, I think that's... Um, I think it's a great thing. I like to play house. I 
I like to play with blocks. Encouraging your child to build with a variety of materials, even recycled boxes, sticks, and rocks, is a great way to build their imagination. Building also promotes problem solving. I like to work with puzzles. Engaging your child in math games is a great way to teach early basics of shapes and numbers while having fun at the same time. It's very warm, it's very welcoming. Uh, there are a lot of things for them to play with with their child. There's a lot of activities. Um, there's other parents there that they make really good connections with and all, there's something new all the time. At the PFLC, we encourage parents to use found materials from around the house and outdoors when playing with their children. All that playing is hard work. It's time for snack. A free and nutritious snack is provided daily at our centers. I love sugar time. Each day there is a gathering time at the PFLC where you and your child can enjoy songs, stories, chants, and nursery rhymes together. You'll learn simple, fun activities that you can also do at home with your child. They also know that if they have a question, I'm there to help them. They know that if they want to find out information, I can find that out for them. And uh, generally, it's just we support them because we say we're here to help you. Well, you know, we have a little sign on the door coming into our room that says, when you enter this little room, consider yourself one of the many special people who enjoy learning, laughing, and playing together. So it's really as simple and profound as that. Thanks for coming, it's been a great day.